Stop at a gas station turned into a terrifying ordeal for a Springville woman. She says she wants her story to be a lesson to others. ABC 3340's Byron Khalil has more from the woman with this cautionary tale. You see where the um, garbage can is right up front? I was parked right there. Right at the front door. Heading home from work Thursday, Courtney Williams stopped by the gas station on US 11 in Springville for Diet Coke. As I'm standing in line, I noticed my windshield wipers start moving and my mirrors start moving on my car and realized the man was in my car. And naturally, Williams ran out of the store and pulled on the door handle, but it was locked and her key fob was inside. He couldn't figure out how to get it in drive because I don't have a gear shift to have buttons. And so he was revving the engine and I was doing everything. I mean, I couldn't get him out. The man finally got the car in drive and took off, but he didn't get far. I was probably down here about 10 minutes when the chief uh, Walton came down and said, are you the car owner? And I said, yes. So he took me to the scene where they had the, the suspect apprehended and where my car was wrecked. Williams took these pictures of her damaged SUV on Murphy's Valley Road, about two miles from the gas station. She says she's thankful things didn't turn out worse. I was shaking all over. I'm better today, but it's just, you. You know, what if my kids would have been in the car? Williams is taking this in as a learning lesson of just how quickly things can go wrong. Lock your cars, take your keys with you. That was my fault. It was a, a key fob that just stays in the bottom of my purse. I just jumped out to to grab something to drink. Throughout the ordeal, Williams says gas station employees and Springville police officers were there to help make sure she was OK. They were so friendly um, and just making sure I was OK. You know, that's that's what I want out of this, that there are still good people in the world. In Springville, Byron Khalil, ABC 3340 News. The National Crime Prevention Council says car thefts at gas stations are on the rise across the United States. There are some things you can do to make sure you're not a victim. Only visit gas stations that are in well lit areas and have security cameras set up. Always remember to take your keys with you and lock your doors when you exit your vehicle. And lastly, don't let your cell phone distract you from being aware of your surroundings.